How's it going, beer tube? Welcome back. I'm Sean, aka Piping Brew Nerd. Once again, here we are. It's your first time, welcome. Now it's good seeing you again. Uh, I'm back with another one from New Belgium's Voodoo Ranger series. This one is their Hop Avenger IPA. Coming in at 7.7% alcohol. Um, according to Untapped, it is 45 IBUs, but according to their website, it's 42 IBUs. So I'm not sure exactly what the IBU is. It's, it's around that range, 42 to 45. Um, it was checked in 11 times by friends on Untapped for an average of 3.56. It's been checked in altogether over 34,000 times for an average of 3.73 out of 5. Um, this is made with mosaic, citra, and ch chinook hops. They use pale, caramel 20, and Munich malts. And on Beer Advocate, this comes in at a 87. Um, so I don't really know what that means for Beer Advocate. I don't really know much about Beer Advocate. I'm just throwing the score in there because why not? Um, this one's apparently been out for a while. I thought this was a new one. No, um, this is just one that's been out for a while. From what I could see, it looks like that they had a contest and this one one out a little windy out here today this one one out one out against another one whose name I cannot recall right now so they seem to like to do that and I think they did it um, I did do a video series you know not too long ago whether it was was it the crypto or the crypt not crypto uh, I can't think of what it's called now but there was you know they did a box series and there was two that they competed with each other so that's uh, essence is what this was you know so came out 2020 19 ish so yeah i'm finally getting into this one and hopefully because it came out earlier it was before all the nasty crap they started doing so maybe i'll get lucky here oh and the best buy on this is june 2nd so i do have some months left it is March now, so it does have some freshness left to it. A little bit of dirty glass mafia going on. Pours a hazy kind of look. Um, that dark golden yellow, almost orange haze going on. About three fingers of off white cream looking head tight bubbles on it so. good strong citrus notes fresh orange a little bit of pineapple a little bit of tropical mango yeah orange pineapple mango some different tropical uh, a little bit of star fruit dragon fruit it smells juicy. It smells good. It smells like it should be a good IPA. So I'm going to get right into it. Yeah. Juicy. Bitter. Definitely more of hops in this one than so much of like the fake stuff that they've been doing lately. I appreciate that. It's it's definitely a better one for their their series. Dank ripe pineapple. More grapefruit on the citrus side. Let's see what else can I pull out of this? It's got like a creamy mouth feel too. It's not too thin, not too thick. Good creamy. Yeah, pineapple, grapefruit. A little bit of mango coming through. Maybe a tiny bit of apricot. Oh, well, um, it's not a it's not a, a bad one. Um I actually appreciate this one. It doesn't have that fake artificial kind of flavor to it. Very hop forward presence. So, this, you know, again, this was a good one before they started getting all weird with them so i'd go i guess a solid 3.75 for this one all day long 
I can see me picking this one up again. Uh, drying this on the back of the throat now. 7.7, it's not really a whole lot of alcohol to it. Taste wise, but yeah, it's not bad. Definitely one of the better ones for the Voodoo Ranger line. Um, Voodoo Ranger Hop Avenger IPA, 7.7, New Belgium, Brewing. You guys know who they are, you know where they're from. Uh, distribution, you should be able to pick this up wherever. These guys are all over the place. Super easy to get. So, thank you for watching. Until next time, like, comment, subscribe. Have you had this one? What did you think about it? What other ones in this series have I not done yet that I should be looking out for that are good, that aren't, you know, like the fruit force bullshit? So, thank you for watching. Until next time, cheers.